Good morning, guys. It is not raining. <laughs> I hope I probably should go around the other way. But as you could tell, our driveway has lots of ruts in it. It's insane. We have to park the cars a little bit differently um, just so that way we don't create new ruts or get dug in. I've had to spin the tires on the Jeep. Look at that. Right there. Something was in my fire bush. That's weird. So, it is 10 o'clock in the morning. It's 82, but with the humidity, it is 93 already. Um, I'm going to go let my chickens out for the day. They have not been out for days. And uh, let me turn you guys around. There's the land bridge still working. I don't have my boots on, so I gotta be careful, but there's also a water snake that's been in here. And I have to watch for him. Another thing we gotta watch for is the water moccasins. But he's been hanging around eating the little fish and minnows that you see, all the little little puddles. So I just kind of keep my eye out for him. As you can tell, everything is, but it's supposed to be nice out today. Good morning, guys. Daddy fed you already, huh? Hello, Kimball. Tomorrow's your day. Yes. Mr. and Mrs. Turkey are going to get moved. Our breast chickens are doing great. Hello, beautiful. You're a handsome young man. Yes, Campbell. Hi, Mr. Turkey. Um, good morning, stupid. Good morning, girls. How are we doing today? Guess what? You get to come out. Yes, are you guys excited? I know it's been days. Come on out, guys. Hello, guys. Come on. Well, come on, you gotta come out. Come on, stupid. Don't tell me you're camera shy. After all that fiasco you put me through the other day, you cannot be camera shy. Really? Come on. Come on, babies. Come on. Really? Seriously? It is still really, really mucky. Um, we found some animal tracks, so we had to set up the trap. Not sure. Come on out, you guys. Seriously? You're camera shy. I find that hard to believe. How huh, stupid. And then I'll show you guys. Everybody over here is doing good. Hi, Bonnie girl. Hi, Bonnie. Hi, Clyde. Everybody's doing fine. We just got to lay more hay down. We'll do that this weekend. Because this weekend we got freezer camp. Yes, freezer camp. We have to slim down. We're starting a little early. Normally we won't do this until the weather gets warmer. I mean, um, cooler, sorry, it's already warm enough. Uh, when the weather gets cooler, we normally do this. But, um, hold on, I'm about to cross the, the bridge. I just wanna make sure I don't see no snake. Because um, I don't mind snakes. <laughs> yes, guys, are you gonna try to follow me? Watch out for the snake. But um, we're gonna slim down for the uh, the fall winter season. We're gonna do it now while we can. 
um, we are going to get rid of Campbell. Um, we are going to get rid of uh, Blondie and Thomas and some of our ducks. We're swimming down on the ducks because we got more ducks coming. Uh, they're in a grow out pen right now. So there's Thomas and Blondie. And then some of the ducks we're going to be getting rid of as well. We're keeping baby boy our goose. But a lot of the ducks, uh, the older ducks, for the past two months, I have not been getting any eggs. And it's not because of the heat or anything. It's just um, I've noticed that their production has slowly been going further and further down. Hi, babies! So it is time for freezer camp. Um... And we're going to be bringing in new birds. All right, so today what I'm going to try and do is take out the tomato plants. Um, as you can tell, they have all but died. Um, and then over here, we're going to take, I'm going to take out all of these. We're going to get these ready. Uh, for the fall crops, we're going to try and do maybe some radishes in these tires. Um, maybe some uh, fall flowers, possibly red sorrel. I'm not quite sure yet. But all in all, we are going to go ahead and get rid of these now. I'm doing it one at I'm going to be uh, taking my time. And then I'm also going to harvest some of these soybeans because I didn't get a chance to harvest them yesterday. So I'm going to do that today because some of them, those seed pods are ready to burst here. And then I'll show you the peppers. These are the Jedi peppers that we planted. They're a hybrid. They're doing great. These are growing. I don't remember. We'll have to look that up. And then nothing came up out of the blue one. So we'll just plant something else in there. I might use that for something. I don't know yet with winter coming. I've harvested all the green beans. And the baby bells are still producing. So the, some of the plants have died off. But there's one or two still holding on. And they're still pushing them out. So we're going to let them push them out. But I'm going to go ahead and get started on these uh, tomatoes. Alrighty. Took about maybe a half hour to do everything. Harvested the uh, soybeans, took out all the tomato plants, and I'll clean, it, clean the area up a little bit more better. And then over here, I'll show you what I got. So, these are the soybeans. This one's getting ready to split open. So that's when I know they're ready. And we're going to eat some and then save some of the uh, seeds for next year's harvest. And I picked me up some, my blue butterfly so I can have me my nice blue tea. And that is it. I am going to go inside. It is hot, tired. Rest up, get some energy in me, and then I'll come back out and do something else. I think it's dark out here. There you go. Back light, front light. <laughs> Good morning, guys. It is the butt crack of dawn. That's where the sun comes up at. And I'm out here getting stuff ready because we are doing butchering and freezer camp today. Why does light it makes you look like crap? Oh. <laughs> All right, so we're not gonna show any of the, uh, any of the uh, butchering. 
but um, we're just getting things set up. So maybe we'll see you when the light comes out. <laughs> Good morning. So wanted to show you guys the animals this morning and what we've done. Our breast chickens are doing great. And then we put the little ones in here. Good, good morning, guys. Um, let me check though. They got food and water. Uh, but what was happening was when they were in the other pen, they were getting run over with the flood water. So we put them up here to be safer. And here's Stupid and his crew. Good morning, guys. How are you, everybody? And then over here. Good morning, Bunny. And Clyde, boy. And yesterday when we were trimming hoofs, we could definitely tell Bonnie was pregnant. So we are very confident she is pregnant. And then here's the grow out pen. Hey, Clyde, good morning. Oh, you didn't finish your hay. I have to dump that. Hi, guys. Good morning. They're all waiting for food, so... I'm gonna go ahead and get everybody fed. Yes, guys, I see you. I know everybody's hungry. Good morning. Hello, baby boy. And there's Mr. and Mrs. Turkey. Um, we got rid of 11 ducks. Hello, baby boy. Hello, baby boy. Come in, we got you. Hi, baby boy. Yes. I know. What is it? What is it, baby boy? Hello, Mr. Mrs. Turkey. Daffy. Mallard. Anarchy, and we haven't named the black one yet, but we don't know if that's a boy or a girl. So the ducks that are in here are all boys, and uh, we'll be getting a fresh batch of girls here soon. Huh, baby boy? We talk about even getting more geese. Would you like a girlfriend? Yeah. All right, let's get you guys fed. All right, guys. Day two, we did. One rooster, two turkeys, and I think about 15 ducks. Um, but we're gonna just grind everything up and we got the setup done. We're gonna gr use this since um, we're just gonna be taking our time, put things where they belong and get it in the freezer. So, what is that, a duck? That's a duck. There we go.
Okay, guys, we ended up with how many birds was it total? It was 11 ducks, mm -hmm. um, two turkeys, and a chicken. And a chicken. So we ended up with 13 pounds of ground meat. We ended up with four bags of just duck thighs for um, dinners. One bag of turkey wings. This is for, this has duck legs and thighs. There's six of them in that. That's like if we barbecue. A bag of turkey legs. Um, two chicken legs and two chicken thighs. Another dinner. And then for barbecuing, duck and chicken wings. So, not bad. And that's how we do it.